not one battery. That's just a tad disappointing. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Sam. Let's start with a very important piece of news. We are, what's the date? We are eight days away from my 21st birthday. I'm so excited for that. You don't know how excited I am for that. But that that's just a little, that's a little tidbit of information. Let's get to the actual reason we're all here. This is a huge Black Friday, Cyber Monday haul that I did. Um, I kind of went crazy. I've never actually gone crazy on a Black Friday haul. Little story, I've never actually gone like in-person Black Friday shopping for a multitude of reasons, but I am crazy online. I went to Target, ASOS, uh, Yes Style, which I've actually tried for the first time, and H&M. I went insane, like absolutely lost my mind insane. You kind of know like when you get in that little mood of shopping where you're just like putting stuff in your cart and you look through it and you're like, forget it, I deserve this, and then you buy everything and then your credit card statement comes and then it's like, well, <laughs> That's kind of what happened. So I'm gonna stop talking now and let's just get on into the clothes. So I decided to go with Target first because there is a lot of stuff from Target. Everything will be linked down in the description box below unless it's like sold out and I can't find it. Yeah, it'll be there if you wanna buy it too. So first are these jeans from Wild Fable. They're just these, um, I think these were like the curvy fit. Mom high, high waisted skinny, high waisted. Straight jeans, yes, high-waisted straight jeans. Wow, that was a mouthful. So I bought these in a size two. I just really like them because they have these little rips at the knees, but I really like them. They're just a relaxed fit. I have worn these like four times already and they're just so comfortable. These are my new favorite pair of jeans, love. Next is another pair of jeans. This is also in a size two. These are called the highest rise baggy jean. I underestimated how baggy baggy is in Target. These are huge. These are so long. These are a little more distressed looking than the other pair. I love these jeans, but God, they're so long. <laughs> I've had to cuff them and I'm probably actually going to cut them and kind of like fray the hems. Overall, these are really nice. I was just really thrown by how, how long and baggy these jeans were. So next, I have a little more like funky pair of jeans, you could call them. These are the vintage straight jeans, also in a size two, and these are from um, Universal Thread. They, I, I feel like the color on camera does not do it justice because these are gorgeous. Like in real life, it's more of a dark teal, um, bordering on emerald green. They're cropped. For a taller person, these would probably come up to maybe like a little above your ankle, but for me, they just hit right at my ankle and it's it's literally perfect. Okay, I bought a lot of jeans from Target because these were honestly like all under $20. These are the highest rise straight jeans, also in a size two. If my memory serves correctly, these are a tad tight on me, but I think like, you know, once they stretch out a little bit, it'll fit a little better. Yes, they have some rips. I quite like them. So for my last pair of pants from Target, I've actually been looking for trousers like these and just finally got them, I don't know. Excuse me, I had a hot dog for lunch. <laughs> so these are wide leg trousers, also in a size two. These are from Who What Wear, and they're just gorgeous. These are kind of long on me, so I might have to hem them. These are so pretty, like look at the buttons. I think these are like tortoise shell buttons. Fit really nicely at my waist. They don't like squeeze me to death. And I really love the flowiness. So now onto the sweaters from Target. I bought a lot as well because a lot of these were $10. I'm usually a small in tops, but I got a medium in sweaters because I wanted them to be a little oversized. So first starting with the one I'm wearing right now, it is just this charcoal gray baggier fit sweater. It's a little cropped. It's really nice. The sleeves are a little stretchy. It's very, very comfortable. I am so warm right now. It's like 40 degrees raining, but I feel so warm right now. Next sweater, it's almost identical. It's just in this green color. I honestly don't think I have any green sweaters, which is a little hard to believe even for me. So I decided to get one in this green color. I would say it's clover green and it's also very comfy. My next sweater is from A New Day and it is this V-neck sweater, striped sweater. It makes me feel very nautical. It's so comfortable. I wore it out the other day. <sighs> Guys, I almost fell asleep in this sweater. It's so, so cozy. Okay, next, very similar to the gray and green sweaters. I have it also in cream. Actually, this one I got in store. I was out with my mom and she was like, that sweater is so cute. And I looked at it really fast and didn't realize it was like similar to the ones I bought. And I was like, yeah, it's okay, but I'm pretty sure it's the only one left on the mannequin and I don't wanna like go find someone to go get it off. But then to my luck, someone actually came to take it off the mannequin and I was just like, wait, can I have that? <laughs> And it turned out to be a small. 
um, which I normally don't get a small in my sweaters, but I was like, you know what, I'm gonna do it. Next, I got this blue sweatshirt. It's a little cropped. I got it in a medium as well. And this is really nice because my school colors are the shade of blue. Maybe a little lighter, but we can get away with it. It's it's an A+. You can tell I'm very passionate about that sweatshirt. I wanted to get it in more colors, but I was like, you... You gotta stop. You gotta calm down a little bit. You're almost out of money. I also grabbed the sweater vest. I actually don't own a sweater vest. So freaking cute. Um, it's knitted. It reminds me vaguely of like mohair yarn that's like the texture i'm getting but for the price this is definitely not mohair still on the hunt for a perfect skirt to go with this i also picked up a couple t-shirts from the men's section because funny story one time i was out with my friend and i spilled coffee on my white shirt yeah that was just fan freaking tastic so i ran into the target and i grabbed like a super cheap t-shirt from the men's section i got these in a size small they were like six bucks i'm not even kidding these are from the brand goodfellow so I just got it in this like blue gray. I also got it in this uh, dark teal. I really thought I got one in burgundy. I don't know. Oh, this is the burgundy one. It's in a medium because they had these online in stock. Last from Target, I went absolutely bonkers. What are they called? Like the high neck ribbed crop top, cropped tank top. Yes. <laughs> these are all in a size small. This one is a little bit different. It's a razor back. I would say this one is more of a brighter teal. Color, it's not showing up that way on camera, but I love this color so much. This one is a more, is this mauve? Maybe slightly orchid. This one is by A New Day. This is like the high neck tank top. I also got it in burgundy. This more of like a dusty purple color, very nice. And in this uh, lighter green color. I wouldn't go so far as to call it mint. I also grabbed some makeup while I was at Target. I got this little e.l.f. lip gloss, and I got this little glitter liquid eyeshadow from e.l.f. I also picked up some new brow stuff. I wanted to try a gel brow, so I got this Milani Dark Brown Stay Put Brow Color. It came with a little um, like double-ended spoolie and angled brush, which is so helpful in putting this on. It's just, it's really good. I love it. I also needed to stock up on eyeliner, so I grabbed this Neutrogena Liquid Eyeliner. Fun fact, I actually forgot you had to like shake it to activate it, so I was like, messing around with it i was like did i buy a dry eyeliner and i was like two seconds away from crying um and like literally driving back to return it and then i like duh last i got the maybelline sky high mascara i've never tried it before it's what i'm wearing right now and i have asian eyelashes so they already kind of like straighten out regardless but these give it just like the tiniest bit more curl and i am so eternally grateful for that also from target i grabbed this pair of heels oop they're switched they just have like the tiniest black heel. This is probably like what, two inches maybe? Beautiful rust color. These are from A New Day. I wore them around the house like <laughs> just to like get a feel for it. They're super comfy and I love them. So that's everything that I bought from Target. Super huge haul. This was like two thirds of my haul, honestly, but yeah. Next place is H&M. I just grabbed a couple things. First one is actually this necklace that I'm wearing. It is a two-chained, is it a two-tiered necklace? I don't actually know what it's called, but um, it's connected. And it's got like a thin little chain and a thicker chain. Moving on to clothing, I got this two-pack set of like little crop tops. So first one is in this brown color, this chocolate brown color. Very nice. I actually don't own anything in this color. And then I also got it in this light gray. It's bordering on oatmeal, but like in real life, it looks a little more gray to me. They're just basic tops. I love them. And then I found these bike shorts and this like little sage matcha color. Yes, I love this color so much, you guys. And they're stretchy and they fit really nice. These are in a size small and the tops are also in a size small. These, I feel like these are very versatile because I could just like pop these on with like an oversized top, some sneakers, fit. Wear these to the gym, another fit. I don't know what I'd wear these to the gym with, but regardless. I also found another pair. These are slightly different than the green one, but it's another pair of bike shorts in that same brown color, so I unintentionally bought a matching set. Ribbed, stretchy, once again, very versatile, and I love them, also in a size small. Next place I went to was Yes Style. I've heard a lot of things about Yes Style. Some say the clothing is very hit or miss. Some say it takes forever to ship to your house. So I was fully banking on not having the stuff actually here to film it, but then it came in like a week and I was like, if you insist, let's start with the tops. I only got one. It's this, this ribbed turtleneck. It's got lettuce leaf 
hems on the neck and on the sleeves. It's stretchy, it's very comfortable. I got this in a size small. It actually fits me very well. I think that's due to the stretch, honestly, because when I first got it, I was like, mm, this is a little small. I really want to buy these in all colors. Someone stop me. Next were the pants. Pants situation was very fun. Um, first, I have a pair of trousers. They're in like this light khaki color. Let me preface this by saying I did check the size chart and I did think I ordered the right size. However, do you, this is this when I first got these I was like how the hell am I gonna fit all of me all of like the bottom half of me into this it really it really squeezes me I look real snatched and maybe I won't be able to sit down while wearing these I really don't want to have to go return these so hoping I can wear them and keep fitting into them but who really knows like except for the waist everything else fits really nicely the length hits perfectly it looks great on me I just can't breathe while I'm wearing them. I also bought a black pair. I think these are from a different brand. They have like a little elastic stretch in the back and these saved me. I love them. They're so nice. They fit really nicely. The length is once again perfect. They're really great. I really wish they would just like all the brands would add this little extra bit of stretch because it's definitely needed. These were also in a size small. Last thing I got from YesStyle, which I'm not even gonna lie. I just needed it for free shipping, like to hit the minimum. So I got this liquid glitter eyeshadow from um, Peripera because I've heard of that brand and I was like, I wanna try some other stuff. I got it in the color, I think, Soda Pop Flakes. It's so, I've always wanted to do this. Can you even see? There, it's really pretty. The color on camera doesn't do it justice, but I love this. It adds a little bit of something to your eye makeup. <laughs> Okay, I'm back. I had to change my battery. I was like, wow, this one battery like bar is really putting in the work. But for the last store, it is ASOS. First, I'm gonna start off with these jeans. These are from the brand Stradivarius. I have been wanting to buy something from Stradivarius for the longest time and just never did. I don't know why. I got them in a 36, which is a US 4. Not gonna lie, they're a little tight. They kind of, they're giving me the same vibes as that one pair of Target jeans where it's like, if I wear them enough, they're probably gonna stretch out and fit a little more comfortably. But I really like the color of the jeans. Um, they've got some rips right here. Oh, it's only one side. I really like this side rip. I don't know why I like it so much, but I really do. I went kind of crazy on the tiny top, so we're gonna just delve into that now. First, this one isn't really a tiny top. It's just more of a very slim fit cropped top. It is from the brand Only Play. I think this is made out of athletic material, so this is gonna be really nice to wear to the gym. Next, I squealed literally when I saw this. It's so exposed. I turned the brightness down a little bit to see if this would um, show up better. It's just this square neck green tank top. Honestly, not very winter worthy, but I just know when spring rolls around, this is gonna make its appearance. It's a little bit of a pain in the ass to get off. I'm not gonna lie. I kind of struggled trying to get it off, but otherwise, well worth it. Next, I'm not gonna lie, when this came out of the bag at first, I thought I like misordered. Like I thought I ordered from the kids section because I was like, there's no way in hell this is fitting me. It's this very tiny blue and white gingham uh, tank top. I love this. <laughs> I was very skeptical at first, but then I put it on and I was like, oh, this is very cute. And next, I haven't quite figured out how to put on this top. I know it's one shouldered, but it like that, but it looks like this. It's super cute. I really love the whole piping here. It reminds me of those dolphin hem shorts that were really popular in like the 90s, 80s. I'm sorry guys, I don't know, but I love the piping. Last thing I got from ASOS was in the tiniest of tops. Actually, no, it's not, but it's um just this plain black strappy top. Very nice basic. I'm gonna cut these like strings off. Like, you know, like the little hanger strings that come with like every top. These piss me off to no end. Very cute, it's a nice basic to have. I don't own anything like this, surprisingly, in my closet. So that was everything I bought. Very excited to make outfits with these. I'm very excited for new clothes because I just hadn't bought clothes in so long and just, I feel like my spirit is like reinvigorated. I feel so much better. So I hope you guys enjoyed watching this. I hope you like some of this and we'll go buy it. Treat yourself, guys, you deserve it. It's been a long ass year. So thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed and I'll see you in my new video. Bye. Ran into you at the drugstore, you were picking up your prescription It's funny cause I got addicted to you and 